As we all know, Donald Trump's presidency was marked by controversy, polarizing policies, and a deeply divided nation. His tenure was fraught with unprecedented events and allegations that captivated the attention of the American people and the world. Welcome back to our channel ladies and gentlemen. We will be discussing the events surrounding the arrest of former President Donald Trump. But before we get to the main reason we must first explore the twists and turns that led us to this historic moment. Meanwhile, don't forget to subscribe, share, and comment about your perspective on this captivating topic. Donald Trump was born in Queens, New York, in 1946. He is a businessman and reality TV star who served as the 45th President of the United States from 2017 to 2021. Trump is a controversial figure who has been accused of racism, sexism, and xenophobia. He has also been accused of financial crimes, including tax evasion and money laundering. Trump has been accused of several crimes, but he has never been convicted of any felony charges. In 2018, he was impeached by the House of Representatives for abuse of power and obstruction of Congress, but he was acquitted by the Senate. Throughout his presidency, Donald Trump faced numerous investigations, legal battles, and accusations that ranged from financial improprieties to potential obstruction of justice. These controversies became the backdrop of his political career, leaving many to wonder what would ultimately lead to his arrest. Let's not forget the storming of the United States Capitol on January 6, 2021. The shocking event sent shockwaves across the nation and even prompted President Trump's second impeachment. The fallout from this unprecedented breach of democracy raised serious questions about accountability and the rule of law. Now, fast forward, recent developments have shed light on the main reason behind Donald Trump's arrest, and it's a revelation that has taken many by surprise. It appears that investigators have uncovered compelling evidence tying Donald Trump to a previously undisclosed scheme involving financial misconduct, which spanned several years, involves intricate webs of offshore accounts, questionable business transactions, and potential tax evasion. While we must emphasize that these allegations remain under investigation and have not been proven in a court of law, the evidence presented so far suggests a meticulously orchestrated network of financial irregularities linked to the former president. It's important to note that financial crimes can be extremely complex, requiring extensive investigation. The authorities have been diligently piecing together the puzzle, following a trail of financial transactions that ultimately led to this shocking development. As the legal process unfolds, it remains essential to remember the fundamental principle of innocent till proven guilty. Donald Trump, like any other individual, is entitled to due process and the opportunity to present his defense. Former President Donald Trump was arrested in Georgia on August 24, 2023, on charges of racketeering and conspiracy in connection with his efforts to overturn the results of the 2020 presidential election in the state. The charges stem from an investigation by Fulton County District Attorney Fonnie Willis, who alleged that Trump and his associates engaged in a coordinated effort to unlawfully influence the outcome of the 2020 elections in Georgia. He was arrested at the Fulton County Jail in Atlanta. He was booked, fingerprinted, and photographed for a mugshot. Specifically, Willis alleged that Trump pressured Georgia Secretary of State Brad Raffensperger to find enough votes to overturn his loss in the state and that he also tried to persuade state lawmakers to recount the votes in his favor. Willis also alleged that Trump and his associates made false statements about the election in an attempt to undermine public confidence in the results. Trump has denied all of the charges against him, and he has vowed to fight them in court. He has also accused Willis of being politically motivated and of trying to silence him. Trump's arrest is the latest development in a series of legal challenges facing him since he left office. He is also facing criminal charges in New York and Florida, and he is under investigation by the House Select Committee investigating the January 6, 2021 attack on the U.S. Capitol. It is unclear what will happen next in Trump's case in Georgia. He was scheduled to be arraigned on the charges on September 2, 2023, but it has been postponed to October 23, 2023. The trial is expected to begin in March 2024. The trial was postponed because Donald Trump's lawyers requested a delay to have time to review the evidence that the prosecution had gathered. 
The prosecution has turned over 11 million pages of documents to the defense, and Trump's lawyers say that they need more time to go through it all. Secondly, the trial was also postponed due to the upcoming elections in November 2023. The prosecution argued that it would be unfair to hold the trial during the election season, as it could influence voters. If he is convicted, he could face up to 20 years in prison. Trump is the first former president to be arrested on criminal charges. His arrest is a significant event in American history, and it remains to be seen how it will play out. Thank you for joining us today as we explored the captivating events behind the arrest of Donald Trump. Show us some love by liking, sharing, and subscribing to the page.